The Museum of Romanticism is a state-owned art museum located in Madrid, Spain. It was inaugurated in 1924 as Museo Romantico. This museum recreates the artistic and literary atmosphere as well as the customs and manners of the Romantic period. It contains an excellent collection of 19th century paintings with works by artists such as Francisco de Goya, Federico de Madrazo and Antonio Esquivel, beautiful landscapes by Villa Amil, paintings depicting contemporary life of the time by Leonardo Olenza, and various works by Romantic painters such as Valeriano Becker. It also includes furniture from the Romantic era, and objects such as pianos and porcelain. The museum is housed at Calle de San Mateo 13. It was linked since its inception to the patronage of the Marquis of Vega and clan. The museum opened on June 1, 1924. The building was purchased by the Spanish state three years after the inauguration of the museum, in 1927. The overseeing institution and the entire collection of the Marquis was bequeathed to the Spanish state after the death of the former in 1942. The building, dating from the late 18th century, consists of two stories plus an attic floor, which is not open to the public. Both the collection and the building were protected as historical artistic monument in 1962. The museum's exhibits are presented in the context of a historic house with a dining room, billiard room etc. They include items related to the romantic writer Mariano José de Lara. In November 2009, the Council of Ministers determined the renaming of the museum to Museo Nacional del Romanticismo. The former palace of the Marquis of Madalena, built in 1776, houses a fascinating collection of 19th century paintings, furniture and decorative art which captures the essence of the cultural, political and everyday life of Madrid of that time. Works by Goya, Esquivel, Madrazo, Alenza, and the Becker brothers, ceramics from Sargadalos and Sevra, jewelry from ebonite, lava, and human hair, a collection of porcelain dolls, 15 pianos, imperial, and Isabelline furniture, and even the pistol Lara used to commit suicide immerse us in the Romantic period, a cultural movement which touched the hearts of young artists, intellectuals, and politicians in the first half of the 19th century. One of the most magical areas in this unique museum is the Magnolia Garden, landscaped in the style of the 18th century French model, organized into four avenues separated by different sized part airs, with a circular fountain at the intersection. On each of the part airs there is a different tree, including a magnolia, after which the garden is named. The National Museum of Romanticism recreates the atmosphere of a bourgeois house in Isabel Line times, explores the everyday life and exhibits the main topics of romanticism. 26 rooms will immerse visitors into Isabel Line times. There are two routes, an atmosphere-based route, of the actual house, where visitors will discover the spaces, decoration, and customs of the wealthy bourgeoisie in 19th century Spain, focusing on childhood, gender issues, hygiene, or technological advances, and a theme-based route, which explores contents relating to the complicated historical events of the time, and to romanticism as an artistic and cultural movement.